Andre Rublev versus Stefano Tsitsipas is the final group stage match for these guys for the ATP Finals of 2022. And the stakes couldn't be higher with the winner going to the semi-finals and the loser having to go home. Andre Rublev started the year off as the world number five, but after a mid-season slump, fell out of the top 10 briefly before regaining his spot at number seven in the rankings. His season record, 49 wins, 18 losses. So again, another successful season in the win-loss column. He actually made four finals this year and he won all of them, taking home four titles so far in Marseille, Dubai, Belgrade, grade and his recent title a couple of weeks ago in Gijon. His best win against the world number one Novak Djokovic on the clay of Belgrade. Very impressive win. He actually ended up winning the title and his worst loss was against the number 96 Nishioka in Washington during that mid-season slump that he was having. To start the season, Pass was at number four in the world and with a strange mid-season slump, he recovered well to end the year off as number three in the world. His record for the season, 59 wins, 22 losses. One of the most active players this year and another massive season of tournaments played. He did make five finals, but he only won the two titles from those five finals. He went back to back in Monte Carlo and he won his first grass court event in Mallorca just before Wimbledon. His best win, he beat Daniel Medvedev in Cincinnati, who was number one at the time. A very big win for Steph, especially on a hard court and against a guy that he hasn't beaten that many times in their careers. His worst loss though, was at the start of the year in Marseille against the 163 in the world, Sefulin, who was a qualifier in that event. These guys have played 10 times before with Pass leading the head-to-head 6-4 and also taking Rublev out the last two times, both this year in three sets. Astana beating the last time a couple of weeks ago. If Rublev's gonna win this match, he needs to be aggressive like he was against Medvedev. He did go away from that against Djokovic, which was really strange because he played so well against Medi, and then against Djokovic, he seemed to freeze up. So he needs to get back to that aggression against Tsitsipas if he's gonna take the dub. If Tsitsipas is gonna win, he has to serve and volley against Rublev and come to the net, do a lot of the net play that he did against Medvedev. It was so effective there. Against Djokovic, he played well, but he just couldn't get the winners. But against Medvedev, he played very, very solid, and it was mainly because of the volleys. This is gonna be a fire matchup, and it's gonna be a very nervous matchup as well because there's so much at stake. The winner goes into the semi finals, the loser ends their season. I'm gonna go with City Pass. I think City Pass is gonna get Rublev. He's got the wood over him in the head to head. So I think he's gonna take the win here in three sets, but it's gonna be a classic. And I feel like City Pass has just been better throughout this tournament, even though he took the loss against Djokovic. He just has been better. But let me know down in the comments below who you think is gonna win this match.